Southern Maryland Week in Review edition, a partnership between the Southern Maryland News and the Forest Korean Technology Center's TV video production program. I'm Caleb. And I'm Jada. And here's what we have for you on this week's edition of SOMD Wire. Charles Public Schools will operate free meal sites this summer as a part of the Lunch on Us program. In a press release sent May 27th, the district announced that meal sites will be open from noon to 1 p.m. starting June 27th to August 11th. Supervision at the sites will include members of the school's administration teams. Grant funding through No Kid Hungry will allow the Charles School System to provide transportation in the area of Mount Hope Nanjamoy Elementary School. Sky-high gasoline prices rocked the region. After two years of somewhat limited travel brought on by the coronavirus pandemic, Southern Maryland residents were looking forward to returning to their traditional summer road trips this summer. But a spike in gas prices brought on by skyrocketing demand for oil and impacts from the Russian invasion of Ukraine has sent the cost of fuel spiraling to the highest level in recent memory, topping $5 per gallon locally this week. Police recover weapons from public schools. Charles County Sheriff deputies recovered multiple replica firearms and knives from public schools on June 1st, according to press releases from the Sheriff's Office. The 2022 Flag Day Festival will take place at 6 p.m. Tuesday, June 14th. This event will be held at the Governmental Center on the Lawn in Leonardtown. The event will feature a procession by many color guards and veteran groups from across the country. There will also be a presentation of a special Flag Day service that includes reading the history of the American flag and patriotic music from the Father Andrew White Chorus. Make sure to drop by this June 14th. Now turning to sports. Smack players compete at Camden Yards. A trio of Southern Maryland Conference baseball players from a pair of prominent programs were selected to compete in the annual Brooks Robinson All-Star Game at Camden Yards on Sundays, afterwards following the conclusion of the Guardians vs. Orioles contest. At Regency Furniture Stadium in Waldorf this past Tuesday evening hosted another win for the Southern Maryland Blue Crabs. As they toppled Lexington 11-8 and continued their winning streak, Although there were dampening conditions at Regency Stadium, it was not enough to stop the 31 to 10 Blue Crabs. That's all we have for you on this week's edition of SOMD Wire. This news brief has been provided by the Southern Maryland News. For more details, visit SOMDnews.com. This is our final episode of SOMD Wire for the 2021 to 22 school year. It has been an honor to bring you this news brief each week. SOMD Wire will return in September, produced by a new group of TV video production students. I'm Jada. And I'm Caleb. And we hope you have a great summer.